A couple years ago when we introduced the electric shuttles, we talked about implementing autonomous technology into them. And over the past couple years, we've made a lot of progress. Today, we're gonna to get to see the autonomous electric shuttle in action. Prior to implementing autonomous technology, we had an individual driving the van and picking up the unloaders from the bang area, bringing them back to the rail cars. We now have implemented this autonomous technology with a smartwatch application where the foreman now puts the watch on, pushes a button on the watch, it sends the GPS coordinates to the vehicle every 10 seconds, and it follows them to the bang area and picks them up. By adding technology to our terminals, we are creating efficiencies. We're able to take that person out of the driver's seat and put them into the unloading crew. As a product manager at TDSI, one of my responsibilities is to work as a one CSX organization by connecting operations with technology, whether it's existing hardware or software, or it's something that we can innovate and be able to create so we can drive efficiencies and make processes better at the facility that really drives our value to the organization. We started looking at how we could implement technology into our terminals. All these projects combined are making up what we've defined as our smart automotive terminals. As we implement the autonomous technology and see the true benefits of the efficiencies, we should be able to speed up processes, create a safer environment for everybody to work in with autonomous technology moving around our facilities.